Hello, I'm Nathaniel Pierce with Go Engineer. Welcome to this edition of Tips and Tricks with Altium Designer. In this edition, we'll examine how you can use Altium Designer to create a schematic template, including your own custom logo. First, we must have a graphic image file or the, of the corporate logo we want to insert into our schematic template title block. Here I've got this Go Engineer image file. Second, we copy an existing template file for the sheet size we want. Here's a template file here. We'll copy this and paste it into a folder where we'll keep all of our schematic template files. So let's rename it with a file name that makes it easy for others to recognize. Now we can open this copy and edit it to include our company information in the title block. I just drag and drop into Altium Designer and it opens up. So let's remove this Altium logo just select it and delete it here and include our Go Engineer logo and size it properly. So I go to the menu bar, place, drawing tools, graphic, browse to this image file, draw out the size, select it, right click to escape that mode and there it is. Now we can open the document options dialog box and edit the parameter values here to reflect our company address and any other information we see fit. So we go to the menu bar, design, document options, parameters tab, and let's resize this so that we can see all of these parameters. And we'll just put San Diego, California. And we'll leave these two fields blank for now. And we can also put in an author text string as well. So we click OK. And now this uh, updated information is reflected in the template. So let's add a special string here as well to this title block. So I'm going to say place text string and I could just hit tab and select auth and type in author. Click OK and just drop this down here and hit tab again. And now I'm going to use the special string equals author. And click OK. And that value Nathaniel Pierce is there automatically because I typed it into the document options. So now I can add a few graphical text lines if I want in there as well. Place, drawing tools, line. Just draw a line in here. Hit tab and I can change any of these line properties, including the color, the width, and click OK. And there it is. So now I just save these changes and close the document. Finally, we can add any of these uh, template files that we just created, this one that I just made here, and I can modify my system preference so that anytime I create a new schematic, it will automatically load that template file. So I just go to DXP Preferences, under System, New Document Defaults, and now I just browse to that schematic template file that I just created. Click OK. And now anytime I create that new schematic, it will come up. So I just click OK to save those preferences. And now if I just go File New Schematic, we can test this and just make sure that that new uh, corporate logo comes in. And that's how easy it is to create your own schematic template file in Altium Designer. This concludes this video on how you can use Altium Designer to create your own schematic template, including your custom corporate logo. Thank you for your time.